Hey, so like, can I re- re- like recount something that I think is really funny? Now that we're back from like whatever yeah. you want to call the last two years. <laughs> so, the, so the last episode we posted was a Wind Waker randomizer episode. And in it, your microphone cut out near the very end and you kept talking. But I just went, Molly? And then like I stopped sailing in Wind Waker. So there's just the sound of the Wind Waker ocean waves and wind. And I go and one more time, creaking. a little quieter, <laughs> Molly? And then I just, the boat creaks for like 15 old seconds while the patrons scroll. And I thought it would just be a funny, a funny way to end the episode. But then it was the last one for over two years. It could have been the last one ever. It's just like, oh my God. Nobody like, knew um, in that moment, you know, that it was going to be two years before they heard you again. That's like the the last song on the Danger Days album, the last album I Chemical Romance recorded before they broke up. Vampire Money, the last thing he says is, this music's way too loud. We're going to have to turn it down a little. We're sorry. And yeah, then they've actually made four like... more albums. They're just all so quiet. <laughs> <laughs> and they're all on um, cassette. Which is just, oh my yeah. god! Oh my, my god! I'm so lost and hot. But that my doesn't friend help. I'm not friends with anymore. But he got really, 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 really into Norwegian black metal. And if you okay. know anything about the Norwegian black metal scene, oh, if you I can ever probably, you can probably guess what may have happened to him to make us not friends anymore. I'm not gonna say anything more. I just know there's some people out there who will know, but. He, one time we were driving, and he showed me, (laughs) he was like, oh my god, you've got to listen to this band. I felt like I was, I felt like I was in a joke. Like, I was in a sitcom or something. Like an SNL sketch? Yeah, he was like, check out this band, and started playing it. And it just sounded like shit. It just, not only did it sound like bad, it just sounded like studio air and like muffled voices. It was horrible. And I was like, dude. What the fuck? And he was like, yeah, well, to produce their album, they played live and then had someone record it by the amp with a tape recorder. And that's how they produced their album. <laughs> that's like a I'm Key and like, Peele sketch. Like, like I can just yes. see Jordan, like, staring. It's so, like, it's so fucking esoteric. And he goes, yeah, it does sound like it was recorded with a potato. And I was like, yeah, it fucking does. And he's like, they're actually so good live. And I'm like, well, they gotta be better than, like, what the, why would you do that? It sounded like shit. (laughs) Oh, God. That's really funny. How do I get out of here? Okay, I gotta be smart. I have to be smarter than the map. So there's only walls. And rooms with single (laughs) entrances, but a staircase. But the staircase leads me to somewhere that I, you know, maybe when I was walking down that hallway and we decided to turn around to get back to Marvin, maybe I should have continued forward. Maybe. Yeah, maybe you do need to go through that hot steam. Not the hot steam. I think that's, I have to turn it off somehow. Um... I think in that like big that big like library room, I needed to continue uh, instead of turning around. You know, um, well, let's when look, Marvin actually called. Place. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, because you were um, on your way to him. No, it's the, okay. The, it's not like time is of the essence. It's not like he's dying. The police versus fireman volleyball game went a little far. Um, <laughs> It's crazy. The fire station is actually like, they're literally just chilling right now. Like they yeah, got like food they and won. they're like playing ping pong and shit. Like yeah, they they they're doing okay. Oh my god. Uh, okay. Be smart. Be smarter than the room. I have to turn around. Okay. Or go up <laughs> higher. The map is helpful. You're lame. The funny thing is, is I'm great at map reading in real life. Like, give me a topographical map and put me in a ravine. 
I'm confident, That sounds baby. like, well, well, smack my ass and give me a topographical map. <laughs> map and put me in a ravine. <laughs> put me in you a ravine. You won't be anything you want. No, call me that. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> this All is the right. scariest horror game I've ever played. I'm fucking trapped. Could I get yeah, an arrow? Is... Ladies and germs, please. How do I get out of this incredibly small area I'm trapped in for some reason? Didn't you climb through a window to get in here? Yes, you did. <gasps> so we you do have to power through. through. To... Yep. But I can't even and, find yeah. where we were. Yeah, me neither. And we can't climb hey. through here. It just brings up inventory. Yeah, you need to find a wrench. You got to find a wrench. I'm Googling it. I don't think that's going to help. Opening Google. Resident Evil 2 Remake Hot Steam. <laughs> oh my god. You're going to see uh, some well, stuff just, about Claire you don't want. It just pulled up stuff like um, get Resident Evil 2 on, on Steam. On Steam? <laughs> you fucking moron. <laughs> <coughs> Police station walkthrough. I don't want to walk through. I want to figure I it out. I want to find out where to find a wrench. Oh my god. Okay, map. So like, I'm I'm so sexually confused. <laughs> you know, Claire like. Is she into me? Is she not? Uh, we crawled under a door. In? Oh shit, 203's got another pouch. Um, There's not a two. That's why we have to find the missing keys. Are you kidding me? <clears throat> Where would they be? I am fuming. We need to go to the watchman's room. Okay. Could it be upstairs? You have an upstairs map too. I am at such a loss of how I got into this like lobster tank. And now <laughs> there's just no way out, you know? I feel like I'm in such a small space. The only thing I have access to is the shower room. And if I go up another flight of stairs. Where the fuck is the library? There's just this and nothing. There's nothing. How did I get here? And how do I get back? This yep. can't Where's be the, the episode. This can't Where's be the, the whole library? episode. Find the library. Okay. Well, let's... So, like, this is the men's locker room with the steam in it, right? So, we have to go. Um, eel. So, we have to go. <laughs> but... I can't get in there. Up there, there's nothing. So the only place to go is down this staircase. But the problem of being down this fucking staircase is that there's nothing to do. Can you leave this window? Why is it... Like... Oh my god. We gotta there's find the library. Here. Look, look at the map. Please use your mind for a second. Where? Where do we go? We have access to this room. And wait, the West Office? What's that? <laughs> okay, so this is the West Office. And this okay, allegedly on. Wait! I think I have the key. Don't mind me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Thank you. Excuse me. Pardon me. Thank you. That's All right, that's what I figured. So I think we're back in the watchman's room. Yep, here we go. There you are. Come here. I'm here. He's like, why does that take you 45 minutes? <laughs> oh my god, he made it. Is that Leon? <laughs> it's Leon. Uh, Kennedy, I think? Oh, yeah. The 
rookie. Thought he looked familiar. Why is Leon just standing with his face He's to the door? Courtyard. Second floor, <laughs> east side. Okay. Thanks, Marvin. I'm on it. Cool. Okay, we're going to the east side now. Got it. Um, the east side, we need to go to the watchman's room. See, there it is. Where does it say that? Oh, I see. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Cool. Well, don't just read the walkthrough to me. Where's the sex Where's the sex appeal? <laughs> That's fair. That's all I know, though. Okay. Can I... There's a fuse box to the left of, left of you. Try that. Yeah, there you go, babe. No, we've already done that. Nope. I, don't I think, think you need to go do down. Look at the way. map again. Look at the map again. Look at the map. Look at the fucking map. What Look. about the map? Get to the... There. That's the door to the east side. Look. That behind is you. What? It's behind you. No, it's that way. That's that the west side. Way. You fucking moron. This is west. No. I know. This. This right here. No. Uh, are you sure? I'm sure. Go across you, you, the hall. Oh, I see. Okay. That's locked door. Cool. Will you stop well, mansplaining this to me? <laughs> that just took 45 seconds for me to explain to you that I can't walk through steel and that isn't east. I will let you know if Sorry. I need help. I was I was disoriented by the way the, oh the she's facing. Okay. The goddess statue. We do have to do something with that. I know. Um... God. We'll, we'll figure something out. Well, yeah, didn't this. Marvin tell us? Okay, yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh, hey, check out that computer. Guide pamphlet. Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know? The, you don't want to know where we got our name from, but we finally passed our first fed, our first federal health inspection. <laughs> While we are the home of pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation, Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history unrelated to raccoons or Big Pharma. In this guide, we'll introduce you to just a few of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. Raccoon City Police Station. The building in the center of town wasn't always a police station. In fact, it used to be an art oh. museum. Nightmare city. Nightmare <laughs> city that they turned an art museum into a police station. Various features like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue in the main hall remind us of a bygone era. That bygone era is 2009. Yeah. Orphanage. <laughs> Just a few blocks from the police station is an orphanage. They wanted to be close by. Founded and run by the <laughs> Umbrella Corporation with the help of generous donations from business and citizens alike. The building is known for its stained glass window, which attracts visitors from around the world. Not to adopt them or anything, just the windows. No, just to look at the stained glass windows. Go mess with the fucking computer. Yeah, thank you, Claire. What the fuck? Oh, can I, like, listen? Yeah, I don't know how to crack a save. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's so cute. You just have to decide that. I like how it goes into that instead of like the lock on the, whatever. The lock that sh that has the same design. Yeah. Oh, I can press Q to turn it all the way around. That's helpful. Remember what? You wanna be the fuck. Yeah, I was about to say, remember you want to be quiet because of the liquors, but That was never like mind. a motorcycle crash. That oh. was a helicopter. Yeah. Thank God this That's... was a museum and it's made of stone. That's too bad. There's that like no fire or anything. That sucks Damn. for that guy. Really like the building just took that like a fucking champ though. Yeah, I mean, it's an old stone building. Also, um, jet fuel can't melt steel beams, so. Jet fuel hey. can't melt. <laughs> hey! Claire. Claire's like, hey, asshole! Where'd you learn to park? Yeah. We are both so unshaken by that crashed helicopter. <laughs> oh no! Claire? Well, at least he won't. 
At least he won't turn into a zombie. Uh, he's probably gonna turn into a yeah. pyro zombie. We really gotta stop meeting like this. Are you all right? <laughs> Please, Chopper. Just came out of nowhere. Surely, on uh, that's what happened. Take it. You don't have the key. He just took a pot shot at it. Why is he not just climbing the fence? Good to see your face, though. How are you holding up? I am hanging in there. Hell of a night, huh? Yeah. This is My the brother. worst first date banter ever. Climb the fence. Or shoot the lock. Just means that you can't get any worse. Leon, you should get going. Awesome. Awesome. Great. No notes. Get yourself to safety. Oh my gosh. No, Leon, seriously, they're getting through the fence. Please just go. We're gonna make it. Both of us. No, we're both on the box art. Damn. Climb the fence. Hey Marvin, this is bad. Oh fuck. Marvin? Marvin, oh wait, the fence oh, just Marvin. opens. It like pushes open. <laughs> it's a pull, not a push. Wait, I have a cutting tool. Well, <laughs> there that was a wire a cutter right Leon. there. Okay, I know the episode's about to end, but we don't want to do another one, so we got to find a save station. Or commit to another oh. one. Oh, cool, cool, cool. It's it's fine. This is... This is... I know where we are. Son of a bitch. I know where we are. And Marvin is this way. No, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm hopelessly lost. Do you know where we are by any chance? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. My Marvin's eyes this hurt. way. <laughs> I know. Your teeth are vibrating. I'm sure, I'm sure Marvin's Wait. dead, unfortunately. Oh, shit. The door, the, the door's closed, though. Don't uh, mess with that fuse box. But there's yeah. a fuse missing. Okay, So we well, probably gotta sucks. find it. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Big zombies. Don't go down without a fight. Or a bite! No! Claire! I Kick love him how it loose. doesn't affect the story whenever we get fucking bitten. Well, we have herbs. It's like, that's fine. Hey, what's that over there? I assume I can use this Not to that. barricade. Uh, here's Ammer. That. The glowing thing. That's a light. Ah. Luckily, I have one of those. I'm sorry. Sir, very sorry. Uh, hang on one moment, sir, please. Thank you for your patience. Very sorry. Oh, also, God. Yeah. Word of my sexiness has clearly spread far and wide. Very sorry. Much bad. Not like. You bitch! Claire, stomp on him. Shoot him in the head. I would sooner take a shot at that range and risk shooting myself than let a zombie <laughs> bite me. No. Yeah. No. Same. No. Get the fuck out of here. I'm in such a small area, though. You know? You said you knew where we were. I know where we are. That's not the problem. It's crazy that zombies just get up. That's fucked up for this world. I see why the city fell apart. Yeah. You can never beat them. I wonder if people tried beheading them. Well, now he's just humping the ground. Uh, listen, I'm sorry. I want to save, but, like, at this point, do you want to do one more? Or do you want to, like, wh what do you want to do? No, find the fucking save point. My head's going to explode. All right. Guys, this is for Molly Ann. We're finding a save point. <laughs> go, 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 go. Um, you're, you're not going anywhere. I'm trying. What do you want? Oh, Yes. That's oh, yeah. make. <laughs> so satisfying. Okay. Green Earl Hi. Need that, honestly. Welcome to the police station. What can I do for you? What the hell is up with you? <laughs> Alright. She just said, what the hell is up with you? Like Claire. Sweet. Hey! The steam oh, thing! Yeah! Nice. Oh my Good god, job, and buddy. a wrench, you know? Just, it's, it's crazy. High-grade gunpowder. 
Uh, White. I don't have any room. Let me get rid of this fucking wooden plank. Doesn't seem as useful. Hope we don't need that later. They've been all over the place. You know what I don't need? we will not need? find this room again. <clears throat> oh, I don't think that's a good idea. No, we were just right here. Oh, okay. See, we're opening doors, not closing them. Yeah. <laughs> More gunpowder. Oh, when I think when you combine two gunpowders, you make ammo. I think that's what's happening. Oh, that makes sense. That's why that's why my gunpowder keeps disappearing. Because forget the yeah. fact that you need like a few more components to make Get bullets. About that. Well, we already have the old casings. How hard could it be? All right, get out of here. Dude, I'm, I'm like looking. You're stressing me out, though. I'm sorry. My head hurts. <laughs> I get it. But, like, that's a risk of the job. Yeah. yeah. Occupational hazard. You're right. It's fine. I don't know. Oh. I don't know if that's going to help you. God. Electrical part! We can go home! Yes! We can... It's like the Ruby slippers. Just like Dorothy. Yes, 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 yes. Thank God. Yes! Now let's see Marvin, who's definitely okay. Who's never Marvin, been more we're okay. Home. Marvin! I hope we don't have to kill him. That would be really What was sad. that sound? Oh, yeah. Marvin! Okay, he's just dead. Aww. Okay. I gotta hurry. Aw, Marvin. Gotta hurry in what, girl? Find a save room? <laughs> yeah, I know where the save room is from here. Damn. God, what a, what a bad and archaic system. That you have to like find a room you're possibly locked away from I to may not stop be so. playing. It is, but it's right here, so it's fine. Perfect. And awesome. We get to go home. Thank you guys so much for watching. Listen to this, if you like Listen to this, this guy, video, kid. Auto saves happen regularly before and after boss fights and when entering save rooms. It's always good to do a manual save in a Resident Evil game. You never know if you're going to run out of ammo and be stuck. Probably won't happen unless you're really bad, but better to be safe than sorry. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> if you guys like this video, leave a comment thanking Christina, because, wow, we're just riding that wave. Thanks, Christina. <laughs> Unless the check bounces. Otherwise, I'm going to drive to Christina's house with a bomb strapped to my chest. Thank you. And we're on a list.